So we are at the National Grid Head Offices for the Future Female Engineers event. Um, we started the day with uh, an interesting keynote speaker, Rachel Morfill, who is uh, very senior in National Grid, and she was talking about her experiences and, and, and tips for female engineers in the future. Um, we then had um, a networking lunch, um, followed by uh, Katie Bellingham, um, uh, the XTV presenter who's done lots of stuff um, for girls in the STEM industries um, and giving her feedback and tips to the students. So then we had um, a team challenge um, which was the Balloon Tower Challenge um, where the students had uh, to uh, come up with a concept of a tower um, to a budget um, and uh, as high as possible um, and they had to present on that based on, on their concept and how they went about doing that. Um, which kind of demonstrated a lots of different skills, working together, um, time management, cost management and that sort of thing. So then each uh, company um, ran two How to Get Hired sessions um, and there each company gave a brief overview of, of what we represent and what opportunities we offer. Um, and then it was a networking session, the opportunity for the students to ask as many insightful questions as they could about the process and what we look for in, in graduates and interns um, and how to put them in the best position um, to be considered. So then followed um, an Insider Insight session um, where the graduate reps had the opportunity to speak to the students on their own without the recruiters present. So this is a great opportunity for them to discuss all the questions and queries they may have that they wouldn't necessarily want to share with a recruiter, all the nitty gritty every day, what we do on the job, how hard are the actual tests, and, and so on. So then um, there was a panel discussion with some senior representatives from all the companies um, and they shared their experiences of how, how to kind of get to the top in the industry um, and there were some really interesting questions asked by the students. And then to finish there was a, a wrap-up networking session where the students had a last opportunities to ask any final questions um, that they didn't get a chance to during the day. It's been really interesting to speak to loads of other girls and actually hear from senior female engineers within the, within the industry. Um, it's been a really good day. I would say definitely come to events like this. It's not only motivate you, but also it gives you a confidence that you feel like, oh, I don't think engineering is for girls, but definitely it's for girls because can do it. And when you see so many girls around here, you definitely get a boost that you can, yeah, you can do it. I've made some really good contacts and it's just been really helpful with the whole application process because we've been given hints and tips on what to do um, with the online applications and phone interviews and everything. I think it's an absolutely wonderful event and I, I would recommend it to any young woman considering engineering.